right, hello there everybody. Welcome to I mix second edition in here. Um you can use mission to wipe no way, that's not how my keyword. <clears throat> Never mind. Um supplies looks pretty. Uh, not good. Oh, but we have Supplies Merchant Guild. Okay. So the... That's a little... I mean, it makes... I mean, you kind of have to do that for payload. Have to probably bite the bullet. Probably just gonna have to draw each other a bunch of cards. Like, there's no, there's really no two ways around it. Have to be prepared to green kind of soon, I guess. Yeah, I mean, you do need to hit. I think I'm going to open monkey supplies. Seems a little. Oh, what? You still have to have the supplies. I don't really like the archive much. To be honest.
I wonder if Native Village would be better than Ghost Town. Monkey. Is it worth it to get a native village? Most of the set asides are fun. Even if you set aside something good, it probably have fun. I guess we could get a second monkey. Not that. Second, third, and fourth monkey, I mean. If you get more monkeys than the game, then the supply plays. Maybe I should have gotten. It's kind of nice to have that. This is weird, poor. You can choose not to do. Choose not to play supply. Or if I should have gotten. Yeah, I think I probably should have. Instead of the marching guild. second, third, and fourth earlier. Seems like it could have been. What is fortune not? The ghost town is kind of the worst set aside. Actually, I mean, it just simply is the worst set aside, <laughs> but maybe monkey is worse. I don't know. I don't get any monkeys. I assume they'll be playing gainers. This is nice. I mean, my my problem. 
Maybe I should have gone Ghost Town Key instead of Neighbor. <clears throat> this will be rough if we don't find at least one of them. Um, but they didn't play Monkey, right? Let's hear them out for. fact, if I wanted to, could mission here. I thought there was some value in that. Probably not. Um, this is all the merchant guilds, though, so that's a little... I mean, we were pretty lucky to even find the one native village. I should have bought goes down. Well, our, our native was set aside. It was a little unfortunate. Um, I wonder if you green. Double you have to spend nine. Maybe you take one province. Or Ran off red. The archives I hate, and I super hate the archives. I don't understand them. Whatever. That's fine, actually. Supply set aside is okay. Not a huge deal. Um, how much? People are going to be buy limited if you have quite a bit stuff going. Pretty much everything. We should probably take the supplies. 
and set aside the other. I don't think there's any, there wasn't anything there that we wanted in hand, so we didn't need to go for the bigger hand size thing. Well, that's a question I get. Aaron. Ripple. They have 12. They can get 15, 21. With exact draw, I guess with full draw, they can get 24. Well, they have 7. Well, they have 25 bucks in. And thirteen. They had twenty five bucks in deck. I don't think that's very likely. They only have one be down. Um I don't think I need to play around that. I guess the question is whether I need to get um more coffers, but I don't think I do. They're not going to draw. That's not possible. Again, this is like a situation where if they, I mean, if they don't buy stuff, it's not working. Hopefully I find out. A merchant killed. <clears throat> there's maybe some world where if you stack the deck, they get. The deck. I mean, no, I don't think there's enough things because there's already some stuff set aside on the archives. And I don't think it's possible. I don't think there are enough green cards. They got kind of close though. Well, obviously, if they still have six cards in hand, then it was possible. I assume they don't have all three supplies or just lose. Play two monkeys there, and just they didn't play any monkey. Where are all their monkeys? I guess they never got the villages, so it's sort of a different situation. Oh, I do have twenty four. Maybe they had a shot at it, and I should have played around it a little more, given that I had the better draw. I can believe that. Um, since there's not... I was the only one double monk. Push the end when they could... Get the problem. Would have sucked to lose to you in that situation. I guess they had unplayed monkeys in here. Didn't have a village. Why is this? There's, do I have to clear this for? I have to clear. It's no landmark.
think there's got a zero land. Ooh, five two is uh well it's probably okay. I was gonna say it kinda sucks to not open with the trashing, but Sea Witch is probably good enough to the Sea Witch opens probably good enough to mitigate that. Um then probably m makes you a little slow on. Slower to get magic lamp activated though. If I had to guess, they're gonna be able to take the threes, which is what gets you your activation here. But So they get, yeah, I might have taken silver. I don't think the, we don't have the villages to make the fort. This sucks. Um, <clears throat> this super sucks. They had, I don't know. Uh, I mean, no matter what I buy, the sea witch can draw it. So unless I just buy silver, I could buy, could have bought pirate, but then I would have had to buy copper since I just had the two dollar hand. I don't know. Um, I don't really have much shot in activate. Honest. I'm getting smashed by some of this. Some of these. I'm just cycling copper card. <laughs> Opposite hands, and it's not been particularly useful. It's still kind of hard to activate. Or Nasala. Sala. I'm not sure where the emphasis goes. But we'll see if they can do it. Okay. This is nice at least. Buy an archive. I mean, archive is going to be the way to do it. If you're going to have any chance of doing it. I actually activate here, which is kind of crazy, but <clears throat> I 
probably do an archive. Maybe the next one a gold. We got a good shot of activating. I do think as long as I do okay on the provinces, the the uh, curse difference here. The curse plus estate trashing difference in terms of points can be enough. Make it work. Okay. <laughs> um... So now the question is, do we do like silver, do we do pirate silver, or do we just get another archive? I mean, it would be kind of nice to play a sea witch. Um, this is all right. We are going to make the sea witch. Well, we don't have to play. We have set aside gold. You just can't see the... <laughs> what in the world? This is pretty annoying. How do I clear that? You may be able to save the gold on the They almost need to have gotten dodgy with the wish there. Um let's save this first. We have five we can save this sea witch. Or we can take Quite a bit of money to make miss as well. But I mean, obviously, it's nice to give them the and to have the duration down. Um, I have to think. I wish I knew what the last card was. I wonder if they near a shuffle. Not clear on this. This could be bad. Well, okay. Especially if you draw the wish. There's not really anything I can do about that. Oh, it's not a very big shuffle. Okay. I forgot I had so much set aside on archive. That's fine. Saul does have one wish left. Okay. Okay. And this is a bit sad. Yeah, I mean, if they can go like Wish, Duchy, and Province, then things look a little scary for me. Um, if that doesn't happen, then it's not a terrible situation. I mean, the Witch can draw some bad stuff here, so. Potentially, 
they probably get to it, right? I mean... And we're gonna duchy dance, I guess. Probably both the wishes get. No, no, no. They already wished. What did they wish? Where did they wish? They got alright. So I can get a duchy. I can have that advantage. Assuming that Nesala doesn't just take the province. That does make a bit of a difference. I have like okay shots of province. Super crazy. Um, what are the odds of trash curse? Certainly have a curse. Did shuffle. Have the sea witch stuff coming down. Uh, they would have to trash curse by province. Certainly seems possible. I just go on duchies and wait until. What am I waiting for? To the duchies. I don't know. I may be worse at that. Um, and it's not like they have a good shot of doing it, but it's not impossible by any stretch. Maybe this is bad to risk here. They discard, that's a good sign. Okay. Can you My activation was pretty lucky, to be honest. I don't want to think, no. Not that. Can't really we're not getting villages, so you can't really build. Um Yes, you can shift to giving your shot. <laughs> you can shift to kind of like what do you I mean you basically can play your money. Rip stuff or can trash some. It's never gonna be huge, super good. Um, not that it's terrible.
I mean, you can get hands where the cemetery makes. But. And you can get. I mean, ghost is not unreasonable. I don't know. Maybe it's just relic. Obviously, the relic. I'm not sure. It may be bandit. They go. So they bought a sailor. I can see that. Yeah, sailor is probably fine here, but not super. <clears throat> I guess you could get some kind of crypt situation. That's not crazy. Yeah, you could you could run into a crypt situation. It's just, uh, I mean, you could set it up with the gear, to be honest. Um, sailor gear stuff is okay. Terrible, not incredible. What if I had hit their uh, thing? You, you know, their thing. Uh, I'm trying to figure out the end. Well, okay. Um, not. The gear, I guess I'll name gear with pursue. There's, it could be bad. I mean, two of them are like coppers. So we're going to only see one. I mean, the the point is to trigger this shuffle without this, this chunk. I mean, it'll be a very treasure filled shuffle. So that, um. Not <clears throat> I don't know when they got I don't really I don't know, it's fine. Okay. We can either You just set one aside and just get... I mean, this is a great crypt as far as the crypts can go. Really. We're not going to get better. Obviously, we're going to buy another crypt. You gotta you gotta buy another crypt, right? Am 
my copper. I don't know what I buy here. I'm still waiting for the sailor stuff, I think. Wait, what do I take? I mean, what am I buying? I could do a cemetery here. Yeah, that would make a lot of sense, actually. At least it made a lot of sense to me. I don't know. Your mileage may vary. I hit a goal. That's cool. Happy about I feel ahead. Goodbye. Did I trash the relic? Oh, they never had a relic. I'm not great at tracking. So we're going to get... <coughs> well, let's see. We can't hit eight. Janelle. We might as well... Maybe just another relic. We bottom deck the gear. And then get hit on goal. Well, I mean, to be fair, that's just like mostly what that is. Um, not really the game's fault necessarily. That's just, I'd pull all the coppers out of the deck. That's what's going to happen. Um, I guess there's no choice here. And it's good anyway, so. Should be able to win. I don't think I'm going to like... You know, you're not hitting province necessarily every time, but unless you are. Uh, I guess we'll leave the gear in rather than take out a single cemetery. There will come some point, well, actually it's not, there There may come some point where it makes sense to scroll bandit rather than play it for, I mean, actually that, that seems quite feasible. Um, we may just set aside money here, not the bandit. There is a crypt in here somewhere. Could have been like silver. <clears throat> I guess it could have been pursue gold to try and crypt a lot of gold. Yeah, seven is, is kind of 
I'm going to province here again. I'm hitting 8 even. I mean, there's some money smoothing, but I'm hitting 8 even. Even like this turn, it's not really smooth. I'm just hitting 8 even. <laughs> oh, they got to do the Sailor Crip thing. That's fun. Probably too little, too late, but. This would be my fourth problem, maybe. I don't even have to take either the relic or the gold here and just take copper and buy a province. I mean, there's. You can be tempted to play the relic, I suppose, but I think it makes sense to just do it like this. Because at some point, well, right now, I mean, duchy is like as good as province for me. I mean, any, it doesn't matter. I may just buy, I may just take the relic and buy Terry and hold the gold. Because it doesn't matter. Like cemetery versus duchy for me at this stage isn't super super impactful. <coughs> We're just waiting to find the gears and stuff. I guess I could pursue gold at some point. I don't I don't I don't feel confident enough in and knowledge of what's left in the deck to really do that. I can take gold here and gear it if I don't hit eight. Well, I think between the two crypts and the. and the gear. I don't even know. There's rel There's at least a relic in here, so maybe we pursued. Well, it doesn't matter. We're drawing all of it. <clears throat> I guess the better thing to do is actually do gold copper instead of gold province. And then you can take two. I've done it now. It's like. Doesn't matter. None of it matter if you knew what knew what the contents of the deck were. I didn't know that. Well, I knew there was a row, so that was. I think. Maybe not. No, with with the relic, you still need whatever. Didn't. Not material. This is a very orange board. Connected to Frankfurt. Spinning, my castle is spinning. All right, maybe. Well, we go. Oh, we don't know. Still spinning. No, I may have to message Nice Allah. Oh, we're in. Never. Hooray. Okay, 
this is another. Your lamp is quite a bit more impactful. I mean, I guess you build the thing, but it's not very good. But what else? I don't know. Is there a fast money thing? I mean, the money stuff always is going to happen. Have a little trouble with the haunted wood. It's just also not maybe not money, but quicker green. I guess is what I mean. it would still play a lot of action. Just the mastermind targets are not. I don't know if you do a star chart or you do. Passage or something. So star chart is fine, excepting that probably playing the amulet turn three is good enough that you star chart. But you can. Yeah, I mean, that's probably good enough. I don't like tide pool in particular. I guess it's reasonable. I guess that's... Tide pools is sort of fulfilling a similar role as star chart, right? Giving you a better shot of playing the aim. And then the duration thing that helps with magic lamp. Yeah, that's not... You know what? It's 2E. we mostly been ignoring these things. That's not true. Played. What was the last bull? Taylor, but I didn't. Well, we've gotten one in a game, except this game, and they saw it got it. Buy this. We want silver to secret kill. I think we're fine. There's a, a well, okay. There is actually a world where you can activate here, but I'm not gonna take the line to do it. <laughs> um you can do gain silver. And then you have like a one, two, three. You have like No, 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 because you don't, well, yeah, you'll draw copper, never mind. Yeah, there's like some mods if you take silver, but I'm not going to do it. <laughs> when they saw cards to turn four, which sucks for them. Six, which is, yeah, no, I don't like. Th okay, yeah, I guess you can do that. Probably would have still just summoned secret passage, but you know, you can see what the idea is. I don't think having another secret cave is in any sense bad for me. 
Um, there's just, you know, marginal benefit. Um, I think I'll go ahead and take this. I mean, I guess if I, I can always do like you always have the option to discard it. I'm not compelled to make this go. Buy another silver. So I'm not like I'm not activating. That's not possible. Um I think I'd rather summon here. This isn't super, well, it's got the silver. I mean, we'll have four of them. Five, I mean. If we had star chart somewhere in there. Of course, if we had star chart somewhere in there, we wouldn't have cards. So we just have to see one of the secret caves. See, this is a situation where, like, having multiple secret caves is certainly to my advantage. Like, just straight up boosting my odds of activation quite a bit. I guess I could have summoned a tide. Well, summoning tide pools given me. Yeah, you know. I could have done messenger just to. I don't know. I don't really think Messenger was the play, but... <laughs> I would have done... Okay, so we didn't miss. See, the thing, we can put the lamp down, so it doesn't even... hurt that much. Um... And maybe summon a passage again. I have to think. Uh, so we have, well, we don't have the silver down there either. It's tide pools, two secret cave. Bunch of coppers. One, one estate. So the. I mean, passage. Summon Passage does give us some shot. You have to find the silver. We get to see quite a bit off the tide pools. I think we'll go for it again. The only bad part is that the you don't have a shuffle. That's the part that it's kind of rough. Also, we didn't find the estate, which is unfortunate. But we buy another. Like surely there. I mean, I guess I don't know what their card is, but um. I mean, I know what these are. It's a state thingy. One, two, three. So now I have to hit. I mean, I could gain another silver. Never mind. This this already hits. I won't do that. 
Um, maybe we just trash the. <coughs> I guess there's also something to be said for trash the estate. We have one, two, three. And now here we can like, I mean, if we see the silver, we can play the secret passage. What are we going to draw off here? Two coppers. So we'll just take it. Because we get a bottom deck. No, 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 yeah, 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 This should be fine. We'll swap. Yeah, 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 we'll be fine. <clears throat> uh, I may summon tide pool. But like a village effect, because I would... I feel like to play a couple terminals if possible. I'm glad I have the so they'll activate here, I assume. Oh, they don't have a lot of cars. Never mind. They'll activate the next time, but uh da da da. So, yeah, I like that summon on the tide pools more I think about it. I may not play the amulet this turn, I may just play some magic. <clears throat> um, we'll summon the tide pools. How does this work? Summon the tide pools. And we get money. Okay. So. Mm, the main goal here is just to. We don't need to do any of that. Take double. I'll leave the secret passage down for sure. Um, I guess there's something to be said for taking messenger. What are we gonna have? Maybe we take messenger, do mastermind messenger. Um. That or mastermind, mastermind, right? Well, we're not really getting much power out of it if we just take the. We are a little bit money short. Because ideally we summon here. But... Um. You just buy another mastermind. I don't know. I mean, I guess archive is a little better to have in deck. <clears throat> I 
and just wish for the mastermind. On the other hand, if we want to try and double mastermind, we need to do that. Okay, so they'll get their activation here. But they're super behind. They should probably double summon. I think summon Tide Pool, summon Secret Passage. Eh. I don't really like the mastermind buy. Do you like the... So, I mean, eventually we're going to get it a little bit. We can wait, though, to figure out what we're doing. I mean, the point is you always can... <coughs> Do we need to play the amulet? Can we play the amulet? We have three terminals. So we Four terminals. We're going to get another mastermind. Um... I guess now we can put the passage or a passage. Down in here. There's some funny tide pool stuff you can potentially do. You can play multiple tide pools and go down to zero. Go up with archive or tactician or haunted wood. There's some stuff. It's way more. It's got to be way more effort than it's worth. Um. And I'm going to put on the bottom. How many cards do I have? So. We're just going to have like three bucks. Not a huge amount of bucks. Well, if there's a. We can wait on this, right? A little bit. We can see a little bit more. The silver would be kind of nice to hit. Um, and then we think if we want to do tide pool. I guess we might as well put the silver back on top. Whatever. There's a, there's like, this is fine. There's a secret cave down here. As long as we have one thing to start the. Start it with, it should be okay. Um, let's take coin. Seven bucks. For some reason, I thought we had way more bucks. A larger quantity of bucks. But it seems I am mistaken. There's definitely a world where we don't find passage or whatever. 
I'm not going to play it on the tide pools. <laughs> we could. It wouldn't. I mean, we could. The problem would just be keeping the master right now because there's like ways around. It's A little bit. Not tripled one would be not good. I would I'll probably keep hitting the masterminds to the degree that I can. We're only going to see three cards, so it's not. I don't have the question to whiff. Three secret passages, and then another secret cave, and then I mean, mastermind, mastermind wouldn't be mastermind. But are they just gonna like green? Yeah, that makes some sense. Right. Mm. Now here's a question. We've seen enough of the deck now, it's okay. We're gonna see four more cards of it for sure. And actually we're gonna see and my money density is not high. <laughs> so, like, drawing more cards isn't necessarily... Man, Masterminding Messenger as your payload is such pathetically bad payload. That's really all there is. That's really all we're doing, though, isn't it? Well, I guess you're doing draw and, like, gaining silvers. I mean, that's something. But it's still pretty comparable as far as what you're getting out of it. I mean, you can draw gold. Yeah, it's a pretty terrible deck, but just the extra gains, I guess, are enough. Um, yeah, so I think it makes sense to just do a messenger. We literally can't whiff on the secret passages. Then we have to think. So what are we going to draw? We're going to draw um, four cards. <coughs> we're going to draw another silver. I mean, we're getting 10, which is about all, frankly. Anyway. Um, the... Uh, those watching in Discord, you may have noticed something. <laughs> what what am I thinking? So it's it's silver, three secret passages, a mastermind, and a copper. I guess probably it's just coin here. We can think about gaining silvers at some point. Um, but not necessarily right now. I mean, this is I don't know. He's gonna draw a couple of these, which is fine. And we might as well draw the copper, right? It's not hurting us.
it's not quite as much money. would like to have mm. this is really not very impressive I have, it makes me feel that there is a some build not greatness involved somewhere because this is really underwhelming. Um, though you, I guess you worry a little bit about what it looks like if you don't do this stuff and you get attacked. I'm not sure. It's super underwhelming though, for sure. 13 would have been nice here, but did not hit 13. Um... This is not, maybe this will make them feel like they have to do something. This deck, this deck is not. Still have a wish. <clears throat> Frankly, golds are probably more power than a lot of the things you can get here. I probably should have gone mastermind gold. I'm trying to think if I can use if it's yeah, I just don't know. But this is this is quite underpowered. Which may be enough. I mean, it's not like they're doing a whole lot. Haunted Woods, the attack, I mean, the attack of Haunted Woods is super bad here, is the big thing. This is actually okay for them. I think you probably take gold. They may actually be in a little cleaner position than me. Frankly. There's just like the the power is so low. I I I mucked around. I shouldn't have gotten the sixth mastermind. It should have been probably gold. I don't think we're quite to. I mean, the only other concern about taking gold over like messenger is just three pile stuff. Which isn't isn't a huge deal. Because we're really not there. <laughs> we're just not. It doesn't have to go to the bottom bottom. This kind of stuff is a little weird. Not that it's... I mean, it's like pretty cool <clears throat> what you're going to do. At least to some degree. What 
am I doing? <clears throat> I did mess up a little bit. I ch could have kept a copper and just failed to, basically. Um... Guess we just discard a mastermind of the remaining things. So I don't remember what I did. Looking at Yeah, I mean, this is basically all I can use. There's a secret pass. Yeah, like, what kind of awful deck plays this much action card produces $8? Like, what is the, what is the end game here? <laughs> it's so bad. Um... It's like super bad. They have more money than me. The question is, can I get to double? If I can get to double, then I'm okay. That's fine. Because uh, they're not going to get to triple, but... If I can double, I don't know that. Oh, what do I have? <clears throat> this was not all my money. There's still another silver and more copper. I'm going to have to think. There's not really a risk of triple from... I gotta figure out. Ten bucks in non messenger stuff. Two silvers. Like four copper. Probably need another amulet silver. And I don't know that I can draw it. How many coppers do I have? Well, we still have quite a few coppers out there. I don't really have it know exactly. I mean, it's got to be around four. Either four or five. If it's five, then I don't need the amulet silver. If it's four, I need the silver. Um... And I do have to find the messenger. Did do that. <coughs> I guess on the last turn we can... We can mastermind the tide pool. K. 
Can they get to... Surely not. I don't think they can get to 24. I could be wrong, though. Um... I guess we might as well put the there's some different ways we can play it too going into the last turn as far as what resources we shoot for <coughs> what are we going to give And three more, and then there's like some amount of cantrippy stuff, but not a whole lot. Well. I managed to confuse myself, which is great. Um, <clears throat> this feels increasingly like there's no shot of getting to double. Right. What are we at? Six, eleven. That's not thirteen. There's another silver. This is annoying. Uh, is there not another silver? Did I just never have another silver and I just was wrong? <coughs> That's sort of bad. <laughs> Cause this is I know what these are. Um I know you know what these are. Well, 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 well. Yeah, just I just definitely don't have another silver. It wasn't ever possible. Hmm. Could take a gold. This is interesting now because the, well, if I had known this, I would obviously have swapped a copper for a mastermind, I think. They can, uh, but I was stupid. Okay, so you can get a gold. I guess you can see if their deck gets a little new. I don't know that that's... All that likely, but because this is like 
I don't know. It's not great. Um, I don't know if they get to like 21 or something. <clears> hmm. <throat> mm. Not my finest moment. I guess maybe the next turn it's not terrible. They'll have the archives back and that can sometimes limit your... I mean, it gives you good filtering, but can limit your search or limit your... Basically just cantrip, which is true of passage and whatever too, but they can... Uh, potentially you can see two cards that you're... That can be... Make it awkward. He didn't go that far, so maybe it's not too scary. I don't know. I definitely would have thought through my options a little differently if I had... Was missing there. Um, I think they can double province estate and it's safe. I can't. I don't have eighteen bucks. I guess I do actually. Just very unlikely that I draw it. I do actually have eighteen. Now, if I had a tide pools on top. I'd get there for sure. Um, there's definitely worlds where I have like secret passage down here instead of this, which would be a lot better. Just for finding tide pool. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I have enough money now because I was at 14 and I'm up to 17 and I can play the amulet for mostly just a question of can you draw it all which guaranteed it all so that's this is not going to make it if we find tie pools here I think we get there well certainly if it's in the opening hand I think we get there now I don't even know there's just not going to be enough um but that was, I mean, I can put the tie pools down in hopes that they whiff somehow, but that seems, I mean, I guess they could whiff on double. They could whiff on double. So in that case, I'm just shooting for double duchy here. Something like that. There are real limits to how bad their hand can be. Um, particularly if they passaged, if they passaged the tide pools, then I, I'm just toast. Yeah, if I had star chart, I could have made this work, actually. This probably is too mean. I might as well keep the... We might as well keep... I guess the nice thing is we can play four masterminds. Or we can try to play four master. Uh we need to move the um
We really need at least four, or at least nine. And so we're kind of stuck here. We also didn't find the, or we've put the tide, I don't think the tide pulls is up as high as it needs to be. Um, what are the, yeah, this is just swaps a card. Not getting better than this. I mean, mostly it's just not working. We didn't even get the tide pools up really where it needed to be. <coughs> Holy cow, we didn't get anything far enough up. I should have top back the secret passage. What was I doing? Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right. They did they used star charts, so it didn't matter. I should have well, I don't know if I could have all I did was buy a gold. Yeah, I should have worked here on this turn to make a I'm gonna just buy province to get a tide pools on top and then I have to add money somehow because I have to have some kind of threat. I guess it. I guess I don't need. I don't need fourteen bucks though. I just need like twelve ish. Is fine. Early, it's already in hand. Maybe not. I think I just need like twelve. Oh, maybe we'll go back and look at what some of done turn. It looked a little rough. I basically, I'm, the action stuff was just bad, kind of, or weakish, and not bad necessarily, but weak, and, um, it was just so overpowered. Because it's like, Where's load old? Maybe that will work. Oh. More along the line, probably all the secret passages. I guess we might. I think the silver cane is probably fine. Um. I think the big thing is maybe just do you mastermind a mastermind mm -mm -mm. well you don't know you're going to have the messenger you may play secret passage like if you do this it's still not very much money you're only drawing one more card either way, though, so it's not. Well, let's say we're going with the tide pools being. Um. I'm trying to figure out. I'm 
trying to figure out where it would all go. You have something like this. How much money can you even get to? So you put a tide pools on. Play master. See, this is not so. I mean, your problem here is you haven't really increased your buying power so much. But if I do this, I go province of state from this point. And Nasala's what Nasala does is almost certainly losing. Um, because I'll be able to draw a deck and gain the silver from amulet and have then have enough um to tie or maybe not losing, maybe just tie, but And maybe he can even buy a copper. I don't know if we draw a deck off it. And we probably draw a deck, right? It'd triple whatever is pretty huge. Or 12 would be nicer, but I don't think 12 is possible. 12 would be nicer. You could get the messenger. Not clear the copper even helps you, but probably you have a little overdraw. We'll just see how it plays out. Oh, the Lord Bot can't play this. Rat can't play this. Yeah. Well. All right. Anyway, that kind of line at least doesn't. I think it exposes. I think it makes Nasala's line not work. That doesn't mean Nasala can't find a different line. Equally awkward for me. They just had a little more money, so they can probably make it awkward for me. But. Well, that's going to be it for exploring this. But uh, thank you all for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. And there will be more Seaside 2e mix stuff coming up in the future. Take care.